water is so important for our society and the sustainability. Not everyone has the opportunity to conduct such exciting work from fundamental research to technology translation and to the eventual commercial deployment for clean water production. Today, Singapore's biomedical sciences ecosystem is vibrant, dynamic, and collaborative. We have been able to translate our scientific discovery from the lab to create biotech and the future therapies that potentially benefit patients. Because of climate change, Singapore's water resilience depends on our ability to produce water efficiently. The core technology for water reclamation and seawater desalination is the membrane-based reverse osmosis process. We set up Singapore Membrane Technology Center at the newly NTU in 2008. The center has been actively involved in the collaboration with other organizations and the industry globally and is recognized as one of the best university-based membrane centers in the world. One of my inventions is a bioprogrammable hollow fiber RO membrane made by using synthetic biomolecules that can double the water flow rate of conventional membranes while maintaining similar high salt rejection rate. This means we can cut the energy required for pumping in new water production by half. When I first joined the Institute of Molecular and Cell Biology in 1989, it was a flagship initiative for Singapore, making the first push into the biomedical sciences to understand complex diseases and to translate scientific discovery scientists need to team up with clinicians and healthcare organizations as well as industry. IMCB has created 15 spin-off companies during the past seven years to nurture some of the biotech companies like TASA, Therapeutics, and Line TCR. These have the potential to create a vibrant and sustainable biotech ecosystem in Singapore. When I first took over the leadership of the National Cancer Centre, he actively reached out to me and asked about how we can find greater areas of synergy. Wan Jun has made an enormous impact. He's really devoted to the interests of ASTAR and the Singapore ecosystem. We need to keep nurturing young talent. We will continue to take Singapore to the next level of excellence in the future. After more than 30 years, I'm very proud to have been part of Singapore's biomedical growth. I'm deeply humbled and grateful that my contribution to Singapore has been well recognized at the highest level. <laughs>